Hi, hi, hi. It's Mr. Aslan, the landlord, on Wednesday, 15th of March, 2023. And the time is 17.35, 35 minutes past 5 in the afternoon, early evening. And I want to give you an update. So what I've done is these three planters here. I've removed most of the chilies except for one chili plant which is still in this third planter and there's one uh, turmeric here it's not doing very well because there were a lot of chili earlier didn't give it enough um, sunlight because turmeric requires minimum of seven hours of direct sunlight daily to survive anyway I've cut them up and I've got mulch here and what I want to update you is I've got these um, pots, I've got 12 of these pots. So I've, um, what do you call it, uh, put some of these, um, what do you call it, wilted green leaves at the bottom to prevent the soil coming out. And then I put some topsoil and I planted some seeds. I won't tell you what they are because I want it to be a surprise. So, um, what do you call it after they've germinated in a few weeks i may tell you what they are but for now let's keep the suspense anyway i've got 12 of these uh, by the pot here and uh, this is the chili from the uh, thing and it's like bent over and all that so i've got avocados growing here which i need to get um what do you call it planted in the ground at some stage okay so you can see how phototropic they are you know they they follow the sun and this one too you see it's sort of searching for the sun and this one as well and how it actually works is quite interesting you see the side which faces the sun um, a particular growth hormone gets destroyed by the light okay so on this side uh, there's more growth hormones, so they grow more, and so it's longer on that side, shorter on this side, so it bends. It's quite interesting. So this one's bent this way, because sometimes at night, I leave the fluorescent light on. So you've got them, you know. Um, this one has been quite long and heavy, and, and because of the leaves at the end, um, it's sort of bent over, so it's gone a really funny shape, almost spiral because it went towards the light, now it goes towards the window, you know, so... Um, anyway, this is another avocado here. So anyway, I'll let you know what these uh, mystery things are in a couple of weeks once they've germinated. Okay, and I've got another update. I planted some um, things elsewhere in the flat, so... Okay, hi, 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 I'm back and I just came here to show you I've planted some onions, actually I've planted one onion here, one here, and one here, but I noticed there was one from a few days ago, last week or whatever, that, um, that's been planted already, so they're two side by side, okay, so that's the onion updates. I plant onions, um, initially because I, w I love the flowers, the flowers are very beautiful, however, uh, they don't get pollinated so they don't flower they don't get pollinated in the flat because there are hardly any bees or insects up here um, so I keep planting them as insecticide because they have a particular fragrance which um, aphids and other bugs don't like so um, you know if you plant it together with um, onions um, even if you know you compost the leaves like these leaves are shriveled and I compost them here uh, they give off this oniony you know sulfurous odor and the insects go away okay in this pot in this planter here I've got uh, passion fruit I think I've planted quite a lot of the seeds so you might have to um, uh, what do you call it uh, cull some and in this planter too. So this one is doing a lot better than this one, possibly because that one's getting a lot more sunlight. So maybe I should move this to where the sunlight is. Okay, so that's the update for today on Wednesday. And uh, this is another onion I've got here. This is a date, um, you know, avocado, got lots of stuff. Okay, see you next time. Bye.